Yo guys, what's up? It's Monty here, and today we're going to be doing a review on a $150 fingerboard. So, on this setup, which is my newest setup, it cost $145, $150 with like shipping and everything off of flat face fingerboards. And I'm just going to be doing a review on it today, guys, because and telling you guys why it's so expensive and is it worth it to get a $150 fingerboard or like um, a $20 fingerboard. So, let's get right into it. Okay, so the most expensive thing on this fingerboard is definitely the Black River Trucks. Now you have a couple of different uh, truck options if you're wanting to get a fingerboard. You have Dynamic Trucks, you have Black River Trucks, you have regular dump trucks, and you have like Tech Deck Trucks, so that's about four. It's not really a couple, but still. Um, so by far, Black River Trucks are the way to go. And they are the best trucks I've ever used. I have a board that has Dynamic Trucks on them. They are good, but... If you can see this, the black rubber trucks are way shinier and they grind much smoother. And so I'd much rather pay the extra, you know, 20 bucks to get black rubber trucks. Now, the second most expensive thing on this deck, on the board, is the deck. If you're getting a black rubber trucks, you probably want to get a super nice deck. So I recommend Berlinwood is probably the best deck, or Flatface is the best decks ever made. I got a 33 millimeter wide low. It's an amazing deck. Berlinwood, in my opinion, makes the best decks in the world. Um, so yeah, they're a great deck, but it all depends on what you like. So I've tried out a bunch of different decks, and my favorite is Berlinwood because I love the shape of how it feels, and it just really looks really clean, and the graphic is cool too. Um, and then the last element in uh, the setup is the wheels now a lot of people use flat face black river ramps edition uh wheels and they use them like white but these are oak minis so these cost either 35 or 40 dollars um i can't really remember but they're made out of actual urethane so like a real skateboard um it's the same material so it's not as smooth as you would think but I mean, I like how, how small they are and how a uh, realistic feel. Like when you go, they really squeak. And, um, and they're, they're awesome wheels and they look really great on the setup. And so, you know, it's all about your preferences on what the deck. Now, is this deck worth $150? Absolutely. You know, you can get like, um, like here's like a homewood deck with dump trucks and, um, just CNC lathe bearing wheels. This deck is, let me see, like probably like 30 bucks. Then the trucks and wheels are like, I'm gonna say 15, so like $45 deck. I mean, you can tell a total difference. I can't even ollie on this deck, but you can tell a total difference between this deck and this deck. Um, it's just all about the quality of the material. These trucks are worth $60. They're not going to charge that just because they're overpriced. It's because it costs a lot of time and money to make these trucks. And they are worth the price. They are. Um, it is worth it in short. I would definitely pick up a setup like this. It's amazing. Um, but only do it if you're like really invested in fingerboarding and you're pretty good. Um, if you're just starting out, then get like a broken knuckle deck or something. Um... But, you know, it's all about your preferences and what you are looking for in a deck. So, yeah, this is what I was looking for, and I love it because I fingerboard every day, and I'm, I'm pretty good. I'm, I'm not trying to be cocky or anything, but, yeah, I know how to fingerboard pretty well. And so this is, like, what – this is the best of the best. So that's what I want to use and because I have the money, you know. So it's all about your preferences, and this whole video was about, is this worth $150? In my opinion, my unbiased opinion, it totally is. Because it, it just, a lot of quality and effort goes into making every little detail of this kind of fingerboard. Check these guys out, Black River Trucks. These are Oak Wheels, Minis, White, and then this is a Berlin with 33 millimeter low. It's my newest setup, and you know, this is kind of like it. This has Winkler wheels. Winkler wheels are also 
Winkler wheels, my top three favorite wheels, I'm sorry, I'm just going off topic, but my top three favorite wheels are Winkler wheels, Oaks, and Flat Face Black River Ramps Edition wheels. This setup, if you are good and you are willing to put in time and effort and you love fingerboarding, $150 setup is worth it. Yeah, thank you guys for watching. I'm going to be coming out with a lot more videos now. I'm kind of back. I took a little break, but now I'm back. So, you know, review setups, like just regular edits and stuff like that. I'm going to be coming out with a lot of that. So stay tuned, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next video.